Colts line up here for the Illinois State Fair Colt Stake Championship for horses and geldings, age four and up, for $10,000. Six minutes to post. Here are the starters. Number one is R. Colon, owned by David Ryan of Viola, trained by Irvin Miller. Tony Morgan is in the bike. Number two is Chevy Silverado, owned by Clyde Stevens of LaCenter, Kentucky, trained by Nelson Willis. Mike Lachance will drive. Number three is Ascot Brandy, owned by Tanamira Farms, Limited Liability Corporation of Felton, Delaware, trained by Irvin Miller. The driver is Andy Miller. Number four, Ramalama Ding Dong, is owned by Carol Albert Hayes of Springfield, trained by Hayes with Brandon Simpson in the race bike. Pause to Admire is number five, owned by Cura Racing Stables of Evergreen Park, Illinois, trained by Tom Stamper. Dale Heitman is up. Black Cat Bone, number six, owned by Dick Hess of Concord, Illinois, by Rick Schrock of Springfield, trained by Rick Schrock, Dave McGee driving. Number seven, Move It, the defending champion of this race, owned by Frederick Lenz and David Jabay of Crete, trained by Ryan Daly, Eric Ledford in the bike. Number eight is Fox Valley Jackson, owned by Larry Binkley and Michelle Whitlock of Charleston, Illinois, trained and driven by Tennessee native Larry Binkley. And number nine is Sports Wolf, the fastest record performer in this lineup, owned by John Leahy, Tom Lewandowski, and Anderson Racing Incorporated of Westchester and Crete, Illinois, also of Indiana, trained by Joe Anderson. Ryan Anderson will drive. Post time, five minutes away. Smashed a county fair track record, five of them this summer. He set the all-time county fair record for Illinois, 155 and one at the Schuyler County Fair in Rushville. But today, it's a different ball game, and we're about to find out who will prevail. They're at the posts. Gates rolling. Here they come. They're off and pacing. Fox Valley Jackson from the outside with Move It also going for the lead. There goes Pause to Admire. Sports Wolf out in the center of the racetrack, followed by R. Colon back toward the rail, heading on to the first turn as Pause to Admire now gives way toward the inside. Move It dashing by for the lead before the quarter mile mark. Move It on top by a length and a half. Pause to Admire second. Sports Wolf is parked in third. Anderson looking for a spot toward the rail. He can't find it. He's going to send him to the top. 25 and 3. The time for the opening quarter, that's fast. Sports Wolf moves up onto the back stretch. He gets the lead by a length. Ryan Anderson now tries to get him to rate his speed going to the half mile mark. Move It is racing in second. Pause to Admire is third. Fox Valley Jackson is in fourth and is followed closely by Black Cat Bone, who's fifth toward the rail, racing five lengths off the lead, and there he goes. Black Cat Bone is moving on the outside. R. Cullen is going to try to go with him as they race past the half. 53 and 4 fifths seconds as they head toward the three-quarter mile mark. Back up front, Sports Wolf under challenge from Black Cat Bone, who's second on the outside. Then move it. R. Cullen, pause to admire, is next. Chevy Silverado is in the outer flow, five lengths off the lead. He is followed closely around the far turn by Ascot Brandy, who's still six lengths from the front. Then Fox Valley Jackson, Ramalama Ding Dong is last. He's ten lengths off the lead, three quarters, 122, three fifths, Black Cat Bone snags the lead but sports wolf is still there move it takes to the outside and third he's two lengths away pause to admire his fourth they're gunning past the eighth pole black cat bone mcgee wants everything he's got move it's coming behind him on the outside sports wolf is giving way in third he's been game but now he's third toward the rail move it a final try coming after black cat bone late move from pause to admire but move it gets up to win it by a long neck move it over black cat bone and pause to admire a new stakes record, one minute, 50 and two fifth seconds. One fifty and two fifth seconds, new lifetime record for Move It. He lowers his own stakes record as he wins this event for the second straight year. Owned by Fred Lenz and David Jabay of Crete, Illinois. Trained by Ryan Daly, Eric Ledford. Picks up the winning drive. This is a nine-year-old gelded son of Satanic. <laughs> Jen Scheitlin, Miss Illinois County Fair, making the trophy presentation. Fred Lenz, the co-owner right now, shaking hands with 
driver Eric Ledford. Let's see if we can grab Fred Lenz real quickly. Fred, come on over here a moment. We just finished talking about the fact that this nine-year-old horse never raced until he was six. That's pretty unusual. Why did he not get started until so late in life? Well, I, from what I understand, he had a hard time being broke. And uh, once he was out in the field, they had a hard time getting him out. So he was apparently kind of full of himself, as they say. It took a while to get him to learn his manners. But now that he has, he's been averaging about $100,000 a season. He was second to Black Cat Bone at the county fair in downstate Mount Sterling a couple of weeks ago. How about coming down the stretch when you were up there at the head of the stretch watching that stretch drive? Was there any doubt in your mind that this old war horse was going to get there? Well, the fractions were pretty quick from the get-go, and he was having two whole trips, so I, you know, I had some faith in him. Whether he was going to be able to pull it off or not, I wasn't sure. The fractions were good for a horse coming from off the pace. You got a good drive from Eric Ledford. Fred, it's been fun. This horse is kind of becoming uh, an Illinois State Fair horse. Back-to-back -back wins. We've had a lot of fun watching him. Continued success with your pacer. Thank you very much. Co-owner Fred Lenz, ladies and gentlemen, he's a champion at the Illinois State Fair.